Good morning, everybody. Uh, who isn't under some stress and anxiety? Um, I know a lot of people are. So I want to go over 11 natural ways to deal with stress and anxiety. Um, you know, these are very important. You know, most most people are looking ways to uh, de-stress and uh, try and relax a little. There's so much going on, um, you know, with the virus and uh, society these days. And if you could see, I am wearing my Cairo Power t-shirt uh, for truth, justice, and the holistic way. Um, I love this shirt. <laughs> um, I know it's a little backwards with the way uh, Facebook records, but um, I believe in the chiropractic power, so which we will get into a little bit because it has great uh, effects on stress and anxiety. But what I want to go through first are 10 other ways to help you deal with your stress and anxiety. My name is Dr. Russell Brockstein. I am your top rated free New Jersey chiropractor. I've been in practice for 22 years um, and I came back to my hometown of Freehold, New Jersey to give back to uh, the community I grew up in. Um, and I love trying to educate you um, and any, anybody else. Uh, it's great with Facebook um, and other social media avenues because I can actually expand out. So the number one way of trying to help de-stress is something as simple as talk to some of your friends. You know, everybody's going through what, uh, you know, you're going through right now. Um, you know, a lot of people are isolated. Myself, I actually live at home alone. So, you know, it's great every once in a while to, uh, you know, give a friend a call, um, you know, give my uh, sisters a call, uh, parents, um, you know, but it's good just to, you know, get everything off of our shoulders. Number two, don't smoke or drink alcohol. At first, it may seem like it's you know, relieving some of the anxiety, but it's very temporary and the stress and tension will come back with a vengeance. You know, so a lot of people think that alcohol is helping, um, but in the long term, it's actually going to make things worse. You know, it's okay to have a little drink here and there, you know, uh, always, always say, uh, you know, anything in moderation, although I don't agree with that. Um, because the accumulative effects of doing something a little bit each day uh, can, you know, do a lot to the body. Uh, you know, I, I always say, just think of the person who tells you, I only smoke a cigarette a day. Uh, that cigarette every day is having a huge effect. Uh, number three, drink some chamomile tea. Chamomile has amazing common effects on the nerves and also helps promote sleep. Uh, sometimes I like drinking a cup or two of chamomile before I go to bed. And uh, sleep is so important um, to help your body recuperate and uh, deal with the stress and tension. Essential oils. Um, I got into essential oils a couple years ago, um, and I actually like one particular line of essential oils just because of the purity. Uh, there's so many out there. Uh, many are good, but just like any other supplement, uh, many supplements aren't what they say they are. So it's very important, uh, you know, to make sure what you're using is uh, pure. Uh, some great essential oils would be lavender, a grapefruit lemon, uh, clary sage. Um, there are some others, but uh, those are some of the main easy ones to use in helping to relieve anxiety. Um, the next uh, easy way of helping with stress and anxiety would be to meditate and use some deep breathing techniques. Um, 30 minutes a day can do wonderful things. Um, I like using things to take deep breaths in. It helps reset the breathing patterns. Uh, many times I'll tell a patient to take a deep breath in, hold it for a second, and then let it all the way out. It's just something that really helps the body, but it is important to take the time that your body needs. Um, another great thing for stress and anxiety is music. Um, you know, whether you like to listen to music um, or even if you play an instrument, it can be very soothing to the body. Um, 
you know, myself last night, I actually went on a, uh, a spree on Facebook and listening on YouTube. Um, and you know, just, just brought back, you know, a lot of memories listening to some older music that I actually like. So, uh, you know, listen to some good music, you know, um, can be great with the meditation, you know, some light music, uh, lights off, you know, and just relax a little bit. Um, Another great way of helping to relieve your stress and tension is working out. Um, it's important to stay active uh, with exercise. Get the blood and oxygen flowing throughout the body. Um, it helps get the uh, blood, pump, you know, the uh, heart pumping, getting oxygen throughout, getting the oxygen to the brain, which is so important. Um, you know, when you're stressed. Uh, you know, right now a lot of gyms are closed with the uh, situation we're in. Um, with the coronavirus, but there are so many ways to work out at home. Um, or you can go outside, do a little run. Um, yesterday, myself, I pulled out some old uh, CDs that I had with the P90X. Um, I also like going on to YouTube. There are a lot of great home workouts right now that many uh, personal trainers are putting together. Um, you know, so get your workouts in, not a time to be slacking. Uh, Another step or way of helping relieve um, stress and anxiety or tension is massage. You might not be able to get outside right now to go to a uh, massage, you know, get a massage. Um, you know, a lot of my patients like to go to Massage Envy, um, Hand in Stone, uh, great places. Um, you know, I don't know if you know a massage therapist that might be able to come to your home, although, you know, with what we're going on right now, you might not be able to do that. But if you have a spouse or a partner um, in your home, you know, take 20 to 30 minutes each day and just massage each other, you know, return the favor. Massage has so many health, healthy benefits and, uh, you know, it's a great way, you know, to help each other. Um, a huge topic I like talking about um, for overall health and wellness um, but also can affect your stress and anxiety levels is caffeine, your coffee. Ditch that coffee and other caffeine products. Caffeine causes nervousness and jitters. Um, caffeine can also worsen anxiety and panic disorders. Um, sorry for moving around. I'm trying to see uh, some things popping up on my uh, feed. Um, but people don't realize what the caffeine is doing to the body. I, I've gone over this in other videos, but I feel it's so important. Caffeine um, and sugars actually destroy your adrenal glands and your adrenal glands. They're little, little pea-sized glands that sit on top of your kidneys. And those glands will help balance hormones. And the adrenal glands are called the stress glands because they actually help your body deal with stress. But when you consume things like coffee, your adrenal glands don't function properly. Um, you know, one of the main stress hormone is cortisol. So when you drink your caffeine, it is going to affect those cortisol levels and your body cannot adapt to stress as well. So let's go on to the next thing I love talking about is CBD. Um, CBD has so many helpful benefits, including anxiety and stress. Um, CBD is, people aren't familiar with in many ways what it's actually for doing. Uh, many people go out, run out to get CBD oil, um, most of which are highly processed using heat, uh, ethanol or CO2, which actually damage the medicinal properties of the plant. And when you process it in those manners to make it into an oil, um, CBD oil also isn't highly bioavailable. Uh, there's papers and research done, one by the uh, World Health Organization, that shows that CBD oil at best gets 6 to 10% absorption. So people are getting some effects because you're getting that little bit of uh, the absorption. But what I have found through another colleague of mine is using a product called CBD Fluid. Uh, that's not the brand. If you are interested, you can contact me. 
Um, but CBD fluid is actually extracted more naturally without any of the damaging effects of heat, CO2, um, or the ethanol or other alcohols. And by maintaining the medicinal properties, um, it leaves it as full spectrum. Um, it's 100% whole flower and uh, you, you get better absorption uh, with the CBD fluid. The fluid is going to absorb up to 90%. So instead of wasting money on CBD oils, which if you're spending uh, $70, $75 a bottle and the dosages are very large, usually uh, 10 to 30 drops per dose just to get a little bit of a benefit, uh, you're throwing away a lot of your money. Um, with our CBD fluid, uh, you can use sublingually um, and it absorbs so easily because it is in fluid or liquid form, uh, you get up to 90% and you're not throwing away your money. So CBD affects your endocannabinoid system. Um, it actually is a system in your body and their receptors. Most people get deficient in CBD, which you normally would get uh, through foods and other things. Um, but because CBD is so deficient in those uh, products, it's so important to supplement with CBD, just like people need to supplement with vitamin C, vitamin D, zinc, and other uh, vitamins that are nece you know, necessary. Now, the most important thing to help your body deal with stress and anxiety is chiropractic. And again, going back to my Cairo Power shirt, we have so many powers as chiropractors. Um, chiropractic, when we adjust somebody, most people come to us for neck or back pain, which in, its, it, in itself can cause a lot of stress and anxiety to people. But when we adjust a patient, it puts the body at ease. When we adjust the spine, we're getting pressure off your nervous system and your nervous system controls every function of your body. So, you know, let's get adjusted. This is not a time, you know, to be slacking off on any areas. Like I said, working out, meditating, um, you know, uh, sleeping. Uh, the, these are all important, but uh, get adjusted. We are going to be in our office, normal office hours this week. Uh, Monday through Thursday, 10 to 1 and 3 to 7. So, you know, if you want to get adjusted, give our office a call, 732-780-0044. Go to our website at www.chiropractorfreehold.com and, you know, let us get those joints moving, get the joints adjusted, get the pressure off your nervous system and help your body function the way it's meant to be. So I hope you have found these 11 natural tips of relieving stress and anxiety uh, to be helpful for you. If you did, make sure you like, and I actually prefer the hearts, show a little love. Uh, it's important right now to show everybody you know some love. Um, keep your distance. <laughs> no hugs right now. Uh, I'm just teasing. But, um, you know, make sure you share this with other people. Um, so many people are dealing with stress and anxiety right now, and I want to help as many people as other. Uh, so again, hope you found this video helpful. Um, I am going to be doing more videos. If there's any topics you'd like to cover, comment, message, and uh, please let me know if you found any of this helpful. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. I'm going to get another workout in, and I'll talk to you soon.